What's up, my glassy friends? How y'all doing today? I'm doing great. This is Glassy Gamer. I'm coming back to an episode of Creative Earth. Woohoo! In today's episode, I thought we'd do a little something different. I picked up a blueprint for a barn because I figured, hey, we need to, uh, we need to put a place to have a place to put all our critters. That and uh, they're starting to stink up the house. So let's uh, let's get started here. All right. So I haven't done a blueprint before, and I was kind of curious just to see what it's all about. And this isn't a ginormous one, but it's uh, I think it'll work. So I think you just have to start by putting a corner block down of uh, some sorts. And uh, it seems like a good enough clearing here. So, you know, why not? Uh, let's, let's see how this deal works. Uh, blueprint. Aha, here it is. So do we just drop it down here? And place it? Let's see. Whoa, that is a big one. All right, let's, how do we pick this up? Oh, we just pick it up. All right, let's see if we can place it here. Wow, that is ginormous. Let's see how this would look here. Hmm. That's not too bad. Let's go to the back side here. Oh, yeah, that's doable. That's definitely doable. And we'll fill in underneath, of course, uh, to make it look a little better. That is a gigantic barn. Holy cow. And uh, it's lined up good enough here. It's close enough, I believe. Uh, we don't want to have it too close to the house. So, yeah, let's uh, let's activate it. Uh, activate. Interact. Activate. All right, so let me go ahead and empty my bags, and uh, we'll be right back. Okay, and we're back. So I've emptied my bags in, so we've got ourselves the opportunity to, uh, to, I guess we just take everything out. Perfect. Come on, just, I wish there was like a take all feature, but I don't see one. But we'll see. Ooh, discovering all sorts of new stuff things here. All right, so let's uh, let's organize this a little bit, and uh, we'll get started. We won't need those for a little bit, and uh, there we go. Some roofing, and what else can we put in here? All right, good enough for now. All right, so essentially, I guess we just uh, place the blocks it tells you to. Doop. And doop, doop. So we'll fill in all the... Uh, I guess this is just the foundation. We'll start with that first. And then we'll just work our way up. What's the red? Rip. Must not be anything. This is big. So has anybody ever tried the blueprints? Uh, I like to hear. I mean, comment below. I, uh, this is the first time I've tried one. Whoop. So I'm really, uh, I was just mostly interested to see, you know, how it works. What's, what's it all about? Yeah, and uh, I almost... I think we need a bulldozer here to take care of some of these. So it's saying, now this red one over here, it's basically saying just, I guess, remove it. Oh, that's what it is. And these are some fence posts. Nice. Oops. Ah, don't do that. So, gotta remove 
these blocks. Not a problem. We can do that. Ooh, mushrooms. that there we go all right so this is saying it's blocked all right let's pull these blocks out there we go I suppose I should have cleared first it's not a bad idea and we'll put some slopes here to make it like a little hill to slowly comes down from the house. That'd be great. All right, so what is it saying we're missing here? We need to put a fence post. Ta-da! All right, we'll do that. And we'll get these trees out of the way. Come on, tree, you're in the way. There we go. Now, this may take a few episodes to build, but, you know, I thought it'd be fun to do something a little different. I'm just surprised at how large this is. This is a huge build. I mean, it's not like the castle build, but, you know, this is my first blueprint, so this is, like, huge. All right. You there, you there, you there. Bam, 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 bam. There we go. I'm going to see if I can get the footprint down first, and then we'll work on uh, getting the larger areas up. Whoop. Is that just dirt? Oh, yeah. There we go. No, that's not it. Must be shredded leaves. Ah, there we go. Oops. They do look like hay bales. I like that. Here we go. And we'll go back to grass. And it looks like dirt-ish. Oh, detritus. Gotcha. So it's uh, it's the bad stuff. All right, let's uh, go back to the grass. Man, this build is actually going much faster than I expected. Are we at? Uh, more grass, please. There we go. Oh, nice. All right, so looks like we got to go back to this block. More detritus. Uh, little guy, you're about to get stuck in there. Come on, that's the good boy, good boy. That's not the place to be. All right, let's go back here. And this way we'll have a place to store all our uh, critters. All right, let's fill this in under here because I don't want to have stuff spawning underneath the world and causing issues on me like they always do. And we'll fix that after, I guess. Whoop. Yeah, it looks like stone. Whoop. Stone. There we go. Back to hay. I do like how the shared leaves look like hay. That's uh, actually pretty cool. 
Great idea. There we go. Now we're going to go back to stone. Oops. I know maybe the finished one will have a little basement <laughs> at the rate we're going here. Perfect. We're getting us all filled in good. All right, now we've got our fences. Really? That goes up higher? Oh. That's kind of odd. Oh, we'll keep building. Maybe it's like for a lamppost? Oh, yeah, that's what it's for. It's for a lamppost. Gotcha. I guess also doing this, I can learn some new uh, building techniques, which I think would be kind of cool. There we go. And that's literally just the center blocks. This thing is massive. I mean, look at all that. We're going to have to like, mow down all these trees. These trees are just in the way. Oh. There we go. Well, at least uh, after we do this, we'll have a place to put all of our uh, critters. Uh, I kind of I kind of hate leaving them in the house because it just look right. I mean, they're not exactly house cats or anything, you know. They're, they're kind of big. I'm not sure you can have a uh, a chiser to uh, use a litter box or uh, anything else, you know? Alright, there we go. Drop these in. Oop, get some more grass. There we go. Man, I'm loving this. For those of you who don't know, the server is currently locked right now, just to me, just to myself. So nobody's gonna really, you know, destroy anything. So yeah, it's all good. Yep. Down the road, maybe I'll open it to, uh, you know, to some uh, users. But uh, for now, I'm gonna keep it locked, just, uh, you know, to keep it so we have continuity for our, our videos. Otherwise, you know, something can happen, and you know, I just don't want to get into that. You know, somebody destroying a base or you know, defacing it or doing something crazy just before a video. So, you know, that's why I gotta keep it that way for now. Whoop. There we go. Looks like we have to clear a little bit over here. Let me put my flashlight on. There we go. Perfect. All right, what are we missing here? Oh, it doesn't like the grass. Okay, I'll take the grass away. Not a problem. There we go. Fill that in. And let's load some more grass up. There we go. Ooh. I'm going through a lot of this. Yeah, let's fill this all in. That's amazing that that cornerstone is actually just the center of <laughs> what this barn's going to be. I mean, look at all this stuff I've got to clear yet. So it's going to be a little a little work in progress. This may take a few episodes to uh, to build out. That'll give us a chance to, uh, you know, do something a little, a little different. So far, it looks like everybody's just building castles. So I figured, yeah, hey, I'll try a barn. There we go. And the other thing I want to kind of build later on down the road I was looking up is uh, you know, like a diamond farm uh, kind of deal and coal farm. I thought that would be kind of cool to try out. And uh, we'll do some experimentations with that because I've got you know, I've got some freeze bombs and some uh, stuff like that to work with now. And fire bombs. Yeah, let's fill in underneath. Uh, I can fill in underneath after. That's not a big deal. 
looks like we're finally getting to the edge of the uh, barn. All right, let's clear this tree out. It's definitely going to be in the way. Can't have that. And I think it, it's literally right on the border of my uh, my zone. So that actually worked out really good. Look at that. It's right on the border. I did not even plan that. It just happened. Put some fences in. There we go. I'll line the fences here. Why don't you want I bet oh no more fences. That's it. There we go. And I like how it's kind of lit with these torches because it gives us uh, a little bit of the ability to keep the, the trash out. That's uh so maybe I'll put a few lamps up. That's not a bad idea. There we go. It's starting to get dark anyways. There. Now we have some light. Let me add some light over here. And here. Uh, here. No, not there. Definitely not there. Right there. Alright, now we're getting there. Just to keep the trash from spawning. We don't want, we don't want to have a whole bunch of garbage spawn here, so you know we gotta do it. Uh speaking of crash crabby crabby garbage. Alright, let me get that in there. There, now we have some light. Lighting is much better for the video. All right, let's get all this in. This tree's got to go. Sorry. Sorry, tree. You'll give me lots of wood. And you'll be missed. Not. Nah. All right, come out. All right. You want some? You want to go? There, I just rocked a rockster. All right, let's get these blocks sucked out quickly, and then uh, we'll continue our build. All right, come on. Come on, trees. You're in the way. All right. Nice. Very nice. All right, let's get these blocks in. Nope, don't want to do there. I want to go there. You know, I think I'm just going to build a basement on this place. And, uh, well, that may not be a bad idea. Kind of like a two tiered. Maybe I'll modify the original design after it's built and just build the basement. You know, kind of like a two tiered uh, set of uh, barn deal. Yeah, that may not be a bad idea. And salt, I think. Is this salt? Yes. And more salt. Basin first. Gonna hop over here now. Did I put the wrong one in? Yeah, I put the wrong block in. Sorry. Let's finish up this grass. That'll give us our footprint. That's what I'm kind of getting right now, is just to get the main footprint down. I am going through that like crazy. And this little barn will actually fit pretty good with a little cottage we have. Kind of like a little farming house. So let me go ahead and put in a couple more lights because it's getting darker over here. So fencing, fencing, fence. Oh, 
fence first. Any more? There we go. Perfect. Whoa! Don't want to fall in. There, now we have some more light. That'll be better. Alright. Now we have to put the detritus. And then some more hay bales. Okay, I hear Krabby Patties over here, but no, nope, he's okay. He's he's a regular one. All right, let's uh, pull this tree out. Little birch tree. Ah, there we go. Nice. Come on, tree. It's too bad we don't have a chainsaw. We could just like you know yank it down. That'd be kind of nice. Or cut it down. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me uh, fill these blocks in. Bam, bam, bam. There we go. Very nice. And we'll get our grass back in now. Some stone here. I haven't really used the salt blocks yet. They look kind of neat. It's just a uh, plain white. Is a nice clean look. Could almost be like drywall, I guess, if you wanted to put it in a some sort of a modern house. And we'll go back to the detritus. And back to some hay. There we go. Oop. Didn't want to do that. I'm going to have all sorts of stuff spawning underneath this this barn, but it's okay. Maybe I'll make it the, uh, like a loot room or some sort. <laughs> like the spawn, you know, like for, uh, uh let's see. Might have hay already. I am. Let's put that there. You know, like for like a treasure chest spawn area, some mob spawns. Uh, that may not be a bad idea. I can put that underneath here. It would look decent because you wouldn't see it. It would be uh, kind of out of the way. And it's in the dark, so it would probably work. work uh, would work. It would probably work really well. All right, put back to the grass. There we go. I kind of love how this goes. Uh, it goes pretty quickly, and it's uh, it's relaxing to build a blueprint. You're just uh, kind of like connect the dots. Ooh. And we'll see how fast we can go here. Try this. And hey, there we go. Boy, this is really coming along. Look at that. What are we at here? Some stone. Here we go. I think we're starting to get like the basics of the barn now. The actual, uh, I might have stone. The actual, uh, frame of the house. There we go. I see where we're going with it. Nice. This is the footprint of the barn. That's what I was looking for. But we gotta fill in all the other stuff too yet. I wanna get the main floor built and then uh, we'll work our way up. Boy, this is massive, but I like massive projects. All right. Looks like grass, grass, grass. And we're out of grass. Good deal. I'll just keep building outwards. And it looks like we're back to this. Some whoop whoop. Uh, 
I think it's following the edge of the uh, the barn, so that's good. All right, let me keep following. Oh, there's a red block. I haven't used those yet. Stone again. Okay. Stone. Stone. Interesting. Yeah, we'll put the hay down. At least that's what it looks like. I know it's just shredded leaves, but it looks like hay to me. Or straw. This is really coming along quicker. I wonder how long, uh, how many, what are percentages of uh, being completed? Should we go check? Well, uh, yeah, let's go see. So, what do you guys think it's at? Uh, is it at? Whoop. Where's our cornerstone block? Oh, there it is. Whoop, whoop, uh. We are at twenty-three percent. Not bad. Not bad at all. All right, we need some grass here. Yeah, I'll put a stone block here just to help it. Perfect. Salt, salt, salt. Whoop. There we go. Go down here. This does have a lot of nice contrasts to it. I like how it's uh, going so far. Yeah, let's go back to our little hay bales, shred of leaves kind of deal. Nice. I see. I see where we're getting at. But let's get our main floor put in first, and then uh, we'll work our way up. And I think we're getting there. We're getting there. I wonder if it has uh, kind of like a second tier in here. Well, I'll have to, we'll find out and see. Once it's all built. There we go. Oh, oh. That's not it. Oh, I'm out of them. That's why. That'll do it. Boo. No, not not the metal roof. That is a cool looking roof though. Alright. Let me get that in here. Alright, we'll go back to these. So for the first blueprint I've ever tried, uh, I'm really liking this. Uh, it's it's very unique. I haven't seen this type of uh, thing in other games before where you can actually just follow like a little template and uh, You know build it up from there and then you can customize it after I mean who's to say you know if you want to change a roof pattern just do it And I like how you get all the blocks with it too. So, you know, yeah, you do have to pay with coins, but you know it It's fun to try out All right, and Nice. And I'll fill that in because there's nothing there. And a stone block, stone block, salt, salt. I wonder if they're trying to make these like kind of like windows or some sort. I don't know. Let's uh, go back here. Makes you kind of wonder when you first see this. You're like, well, how? You know, you drop a few blocks. You're like, hmm, that doesn't make sense. But then afterwards, I guess when you look at it, it's gonna be like make total sense. Good. Here we go. Oop. What's that sound? We got a tornado coming. Ooh. Must be some mobs underneath me or by me. 
Oh, out again. Here we go. Nice. Kind of get like the battle music kind of thing, but I'm not seeing anything. Is it you? Is it you, Pebble? You're doing it, Pebble. That's what I thought. Here we go. Whoop. Don't want to do that. Or that. Whoop. Gotta use this block here. Uh, I like how it kind of just guides you along and says, yep, yep, nope, yep, 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 nope, nope, don't do it that way. Let's see how we got, what we got here. All right, so. It's saying it doesn't like these blocks. So let's fix that. I think it wanted a, a, a grassy block instead. There we go. Now it's got. Ha now it's happy. Oop, don't want to do that. And don't want to do that. Perfect. All right, there we go. We fixed it. The unhappiness feature. Why is it yellow here? Do I have to remove those? Is that what it wants? Oh, that's weird. Anyway, I'll clear it out. Not a problem. There we go. Cleared out. Now you're happy. Alright, let's go back to here. Whoop. I'll tell you what, those little keepers are going to have uh, lots of places to move around now. What's the deal with the flowers? Oh, there is a flower you put down. Makes sense. Ta-da! Isn't that creative? All right. Now we're over here. Nice. Ooh. Now we're going to go back to these. So, let's see. How are we doing here so far? This is getting nice and big. We're looking at almost the entire footprints down now. I hope. Let's keep going. Want to get at least that done. There we go. No, no, no. There. The barn is much, you know, wait. The barn is much bigger than I expected, so I'm kind of liking that. It doesn't look as big in the picture, but this thing is, is pretty massive. Well, as far as the footprint, I mean, look at this. It goes all the way out to here. And, uh, wow, that is, that's going to be a great size. So let's just follow the uh, basic footprint around. And then we'll fill it in. Get the corner pieces. Kind of like doing a puzzle. You want to do the uh, the outside first. And then work your way in. Although we kind of messed that part up, didn't we? <laughs> Alright, let's uh, crap, put that in there. Oops, don't. I wonder if it goes any further. No, I guess not. I think we hit her edge. There we go. Whoa! Hello. All right, let's put that in. Whoop. Almost made her a little bridge. Mushrooms gotta go, sorry. Uh, what do we have here? Sounds like a dog. What is that sound? Is there like a feral pigsy around or something? Well, let's 
take these blocks out. As they are going to be right in my way. Here we go. Are, are you making a sound? Oh, it's you. The little lizard's making a sound. What, what are you doing? Right, got it. There. You're too noisy. Ah, that's better. Now back to the build. Here we go. Nice. So it's really I think we've got our our perimeter down now. So let's uh let's keep filling in. Oops. Oop. There we go. Ah. Take that out and need more grass. You know, let's do this. We're, We're using a lot more of these. We'll put them in order. Make it a little, a little more. A little easier, we'll say. There we go. That's what I'm looking for, a little easier. All right, let's keep going. Bam. And if uh, if you guys like the blueprint we've done here, maybe we'll try another one just for, uh, you know, for the fun of it. Uh, the blueprints seem to be, you know, they're fun, they're fun to uh, kind of like let's be, you know, builds, you know, kind of deal. And here we go. Plus, uh, if you haven't seen it, it gives you the chance to, to see how it looks finished. Now you can decide on whether you're going to get it or not. Or build it or not. Here we go. But they do build quick. Lots of hay here. Shredded leaves. It must be like right on the border of where the barn itself is because it looks like uh, these are just like stable yards or some sort. Oop. Put that there. And I will go to this block. Perfect. And back to the grass. Oh, we filled that one in good. All right, we'll go back to here. There, whoop, 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 whoop. Can't do it that way. And I like that it has a perimeter fence to keep the critters uh, from running off. So I guess you can put them on wander. Uh, I'm not sure if they'll climb over fences. I haven't tested that out yet. Uh, but maybe I'll try it. We'll see if they... Whoa, don't, don't fall. Don't fall. I'm going to need a ladder here if I keep it up. And we'll go back to here. Whoops. Come on. Didn't mean you. I'm not here. There we go. Perfect. And this probably just goes all the way down, so I'll just gotta keep following that line. There we go. And a great thing about the barn is cats like barns because it's full of mice. So we're all set there. All right, let me get that stone block in. And bam, bam. Love how this goes. I'm glad I tried it out. I haven't tried these before. So uh, this is the first on camera trying a blueprint. Go squeeze that under there. Get these little grass ones out of the way. There we go. Boy, this is really coming along. 
All right, we'll go back to the need some more shred leaves. There we go. It's gonna be cool once we start building the walls of this. I th I can't wait to see how it's gonna look. And bam. I think we're getting close to seeing the walls here. With all the stone. Very nice. It's kind of like a little pathway. Oh, huh. that's different. And here we go. Put these down. Whoop. Don't want to do that. Whoop. Or that. I'm going to do that. There we go. I like that it has, it looks like it has like a little interior um, staple areas to like partition the animals too, because it looks like kind of like little interior uh, pens. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. All right, we'll keep plugging away here. And uh, oh, so I figured I'd let you guys know, I am in the process of building a studio uh, I've been doing it as I can afford it, obviously. And uh, what I've been doing is I'm making a soundproofed uh, studio slash office. So once I get that built, we're going to be able to do a lot more videos. We're going to do some streaming. And uh, yeah, we'll be doing quite a bit more. Not just, uh, you know, not just, you know, four or five videos a week. We'll be doing quite a few more videos a week. So that'd be great. And let me get that in there. Uh, the studio itself, just to give you an idea how it's uh, going to look, I'm going with uh, a product called Roxol, which is uh, soundproof insulation. I am also adding in, for those who are interested, just to pass the time here, I'm adding uh, two layers of 5 8 inch sheet rocks on each side. So we're looking at, you know, inch and a half worth of sheet rock on each side of the wall, which is pretty heavy to say the least and uh between the sheetrock i'm gonna have green glue which is a uh, it's a product that absorbs sound and it turns it into heat which is a kind of cool product a really cool concept and what it does in the process is it absorbs sound and it soundproofs and uh on top of that i've got these little uh, clips that attach to the studs and uh what they do is they absorb sound as well. And you take these bars called resilient channels. And what you do is you mount them to the clips. And these clips will actually allow you to uh, absorb even more sound. And uh, that way it uh, kind of separates it. So we're going to have a nice, uh, nice tight studio as far as uh, the soundproofing goes. And uh, the great part is, you know, we won't have any interruptions. Uh, be able to stream more, no problems at all. So that'd be great. And of course, I'll probably pick up a new desk and chair to go with it. Uh, that way it's not going to look too bad. All right, so what do we have here? We've, do we have the entire first layer down? Let's take a look. Let's do a quick run through here. That was kind of my goal today is get the first layer down. And this is massive. Ew, what is it saying here? It doesn't like this block. You you don't like that block. What what don't you like about it? You you don't like that block. What what's the deal? You just don't want that block there. Hmm. Okay, that's kind of weird, but okay, we'll we'll go with it. Not a problem. All right, so it looks like we did it. So, you know, I think I'm going to wrap up this episode right here. This is Blasted Gamer. I'd like to take this time to thank all my viewers and all my subscribers. Thank you all so very much. Without all of you, this would be a thing. If you enjoyed this episode, please smash that like button and comment below. And as always, if you have not done so, please subscribe and stay glassy. Bye-bye.